What's up, YouTube? This is Madcock83, and I guess I will start a Let's Play uh, with a ton of mods. Uh, this is the DNS tech pack I'm using. Uh, I'll put a link somewhere where you can find it. There's actually a new installer for it. It's very easy to install, and it's a ton of mods. Uh, let's see, Buildcraft, uh, a lot of add-ons for Buildcraft, a lot of your pipes, and additional pipes, Industrial Craft, a few add-ons for it. Uh, equivalent exchange, uh, railcraft, forestry, uh, a ton of other little mods that kind of help those out. This does include a lot of the cheat mods, uh, the cheat mod, not enough items, and single player commands. I don't really plan on using them unless I absolutely have to. This is kind of a, a let's play slash spotlight for some of these. In each episode we'll try to concentrate on one thing. Um, at the current time, being my account what it is on YouTube, I can't upload anything longer than 15 minutes because I'm not a partner, but I kind of am a revenue sharing partner, so until YouTube gets their stuff straightened out, I can't really upload more than 15 minutes. So I'll do what I can in that time. <coughs> I was going to generate a brand new world, but when I was testing everything, I kind of generated one world to make sure everything works, and it's awesome. I really, 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 really like it. So we're just going to play on it. Um, I'll throw a C down in the description so you can hopefully generate this one. I'll also upload uh, my map. Alright, you see I also have a mini map. Um, I really like the spawn. And as you'll see as we play, we'll take down some of the sound effects and whatnot to our there's some of the red power rubber trees and once we get over that way there's a huge oil spawn that's actually at the top of one of those trees um, we have some rubber trees over here I'm thinking there's a mod in here and I, I'm forgetting the name I think it's cake or Kate something that generates worlds like this and I'm thinking we're going to make our home in one of these buildings here. And since I've already started this world, we're kind of already hitting nighttime. So I'm going to cheat this one time to start it over since we're just starting at the top. We also have some oil over here from Buildcraft. That's nice, nice, nice. And, oh, this also has too many ores. Not too many ores. Uh, ores plus or something? I, I can't remember what it is, but it makes ores generate a ton, and such as diamond and lapis will spawn towards the top of the world. I'm doing this simply so I can get items quicker and show you what we need to show you. You don't have to add this into your, uh, into your download if you don't want it. So, I think I'm going to gather some wood and get started. I'll be right back. <coughs> Alright, uh, you can see I grabbed just a few things. I only cut down some wood. Those are the trees I cut down that were over there. Shut up, Cal. Um, I think we're going to make the house right about here, huh? Uh, let's go ahead and... Oh, we got plenty of wood. bench. And place that down. Hell. <clears throat> Get us a few basic necessities. What I'm thinking is we'll start mining right around in here. Now get started on mine, I'll come back if I find anything good. And I think too far and I've already found diamond, and like I said, this mod adds it anywhere in the world. So, as you can see, I'm at pretty much ground level. Uh, and we do have some coal, which we do... I'm going to have to get so y'all guys can have some light and see what's going on. Oh, I also have auto torch installed. 
Let's disable that. It will automatically place torches as long as they're in your inventory. Which is great when you're looking around a uh, when you're looking around a cave, it'll place them for you. But just for this, I need to place them on my own. And we'll uh, kind of secure this. So hopefully, we don't get eaten. And maybe we'll make this our base. So I'll be back when I find something else interesting. And I was digging, we also found our first piece of either uranium or emerald. I honestly cannot remember. We might not be able to break it with a stone torch, though. And I'm horrible at pushing the wrong buttons, you will learn this. <coughs> and then I'm thinking this first episode will probably be just the basics getting started, getting a few things that we need. Uh, um, I've already found a bunch of diamond that I can't mine because I don't have anything strong enough to mine it with. But I do want this coal. We're going to need it for several, several things. And again, we're just collecting. Trying to get a good start. We only got tons of lapis, which I don't really need yet. I'll come into play for industrial craft and uh, red power and a few logic pipes also for build craft. It seems to be the main thing I'm finding as of right now. And I'll keep digging. We'll be back. All right. Uh, made some bare essentials. Um, that's where we came in. I'm just trying to clean this area. Oh no. I'm just trying to clean the area up a little bit. Uh, I got us some iron cooking. And we've already found gold. And again, unless you install that mod, you're not going to find stuff as fast as I am. And it's always a good idea before you start digging it to dig around it. It tends to spawn a little bit more stuff. I already got some more iron down there. And I decided to go ahead and cook up some of the iron so we could mine some of this because I got a ton of diamond around me I can't get at the moment. And the goal of this whole thing is to be completely automated and we're going to have um, machines doing all this work for us. Most important, the quarry for build craft. Uh, we use a lot of red power items to separate and industrial craft items to multiply as much of this as we can, such as macerators and generators. And all that good, good stuff. And I've decided to go ahead and mine some of the diamonds since there's so many around. Didn't really know this was going to be that big. Oh, this is kind of ridiculous. I don't know what's going to be this, <laughs> this many items. I'm going to go from this little mod. I just wanted to make it a little easier so I could get some, uh, some of the rare items quicker. I didn't really want more of them. That looks like we'll never run out. Alright, we got a little area cleaned out. We left most of the stuff in the walls. Uh, wrong button. Uh, a few other orders right in here. It's tin and, and copper. Now, I think, uh, what do we got? Um, I know industrial craft adds it. Forestry adds it. And I think red power adds some too. Uh, oh, that's right there. So we got three different kinds of iron, which is probably going to cause us a problem later on. We're trying to make recipes and using the wrong type of iron. Uh, we'll come back and get this stuff later. I think some of the first things we need to build are going to be some industrial craft, uh, energy producers, and macerators, compressors, all that good stuff. So let me get my inventory cleaned up and we'll see what we can do about some of those. Alright, well the first thing we're going to need here is a tree tap. And the nice thing about not too many items is if you hover over an item you're looking at and hit R, it will give you the recipe for it. So, let's get to crafting a few of those if I remember it right. Let's put that back where it was. There we go. Let's get a few of them. And we're going to have to go find some rubber trees. 
And as soon as I turn the corner, a cow hit me in the face. Get up, that guy. Uh, there's one right there. If you right click on it, some resin will pop out. And it will eventually grow back. So I'm going to locate some more of these bad boys and be right back. It took me forever, but I found some uh, rubber. Uh, or, excuse me, sticky resin right now. It's cooking up in the furnace to give me rubber. Uh, I got another one over here doing the exact same thing. <coughs> Once we get this, we can make some cables and circuits and all kinds of stuff. Which, uh, probably going to start putting in this room. Uh, for now, we use a compressor, I mean, a generator to get energy. And at some point, ooh, ah, it seems to be dark all the time. Let's keep that closed. Maybe I should make a door. Um, but once that gets going, we'll make some solar panels to get power. And um, after this rubber is done, which I, well, we can go ahead and make some cable. As you see, these are both copper. Uh, one's copper, one's copper ingot, but they can. They'll make under the insulated copper cable, and I'm, I don't think this one is. Uh, I think this is a forestry one. But having f uh, forge installed, it makes it all the same. It interchanges, you know, this copper ingot is the same as another copper ingot, which is really good. So what we're going to do, it's going to be one short. We're going to make some cables. Can't do any more with those. And let's make some more of these. Boom, boom, boom. And I'll leave us one extra. And you see they stack on top of each other. These two won't, unfortunately. Well, let's get us some rubber. Go back over hell. I believe if we put it, the rubber like this, with cables in the middle. Oh, that's not right. Well, that was completely wrong. Um, I don't understand. I had to look up the recipe for it, and it's ingots. So I went back and pulled some more of my ores and uh, smelted them down. Um, it's weird because I, I think this recipe is weird because the other ones you have to make cables first. And then you get uh, you make the cable first and then you surround it with rubber and you get one of these. It's only 18 cables. So that'll be our start. And what we're going to have to decide how to do this, I think we should get a compressor first. We'll probably have to mine some more coal or trees. There's some more copper there. Uh, let me figure out how I want to do it, and I'll be right back. All right, the first thing we're going to build is a generator. And um, first thing we're going to need is a Let's see if we can't find it. There's our generator. Our recipe. We're going to need a rechargeable battery, a machine block, and a furnace. Uh, let me see. Let's take some of this iron. If we put it in here like so. An iron furnace. We don't want an iron furnace. A we'll block of iron either. Whoops, alright, first thing we're going to have to do is make refined iron. I forgot machine blocks take refined iron. <coughs> we'll just wait for those to cook up and I'll be back. Alright, there we go. Now let's try this again. I want the rest of those cook up as well, because I'm sure we're going to need some more here shortly. There we go. we got our machine block. We're also going to need another furnace. And let's see, yes, tin is done. Let's just check our inventory. Yeah, we're going to need some redstone. If I remember right, it's redstone, tin, and one cable. There we go. Oh, could have stayed in there. Put our rechargeable battery on top, our furnace on the bottom, and our machine block on the bottom. In the middle, and we get a generator. Now. Oh, and also I made, went ahead and made me some diamond tools since they're so abundant. Uh, we'll start it up here. 